We're going to start some Nigunim. And yes, I like think. Hear us? All right. Facebook people, can you please let us know? YouTube, YouTube. Sorry, YouTube. YouTube. Facebook, we're good. Um, let's just make sure that it's working. So I invite you guys to, while while we're singing these Nagunim, please close your eyes, try to sing, hum along, sing along, try to connect just for a few minutes, uh, loud and clear. Okay, here we go. <laughs> So we're live on Instagram and on YouTube. So please join us there. Sorry about that. Um, I was saying before that the last two weeks or so has seemed like years. It seems like we've all gotten older. And that's what pain does to a person. And the process for me personally of, like I've always been taught to transform that pain into yearning and into hope and into tefillah and into davening has been super difficult and part of that i think is that we are absolutely flooded with information and flooded with visuals and flooded with pain and i really believe and i'm sure Gershon agrees with me that hashem doesn't necessarily want us to be flooded hashem wants us to know hashem wants us to feel but so we're going to do again we're going to sing a couple in the gunim just to get into it a little bit and then my brother-in-law Gershon is going to do some really beautiful breath work. And I, I really, really, really encourage to those of you who know breath work already, 
you know what it is. To those who don't know, if you're um, if you have hesitations, or you're skeptical about it, trust me, as they say, uh, it's very, very special. So even if you could just do five, ten minutes with us, it'll be really, really sweet. So let's sing it again. Try to connect. Try to connect to these words together. Shaimed, Shaimed, Israel. Shaimed, Shaimed, Israel. Shema Yisrael, Israel. Shema Yisrael, Israel. Ayayvan. Israel, <laughs> Israel, I together wherever you are. Da 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 That all of the captive, that all of the captives, all of the Halagi Yidin, who's uh, it's, the mind doesn't just can't comprehend, can't cannot comprehend the amount of pain and loneliness and anguish our flesh and blood are sitting somewhere in the hands of the most evil people in the world, and we ask. That uh, that Hashem bring them bring them back to Zion with happiness, with happiness. And I wanted to tell you one thing that this is a nigger from Rav Shlomo Karabach, and I heard this nigger when I was maybe 15 or 16 years old, and I actually heard the recording of Rav Shlomo composing it, and you could hear in the background he's singing, he's singing the the lower part a couple of times over. And that's normal while you're composing a nigan to wait before you go to the next parts. But you can hear there's a little bit of a 
just a lot of noise in the room, and he quiets everybody down. And he says, Chavah, if you're standing, stand. If you're sitting, sit. But please be quiet. I'm not just dragging this out of my heart. And that was the moment on a personal level that I said that I want to be like that. I want to be like that. I'm not saying I am that. Halavai, one day I should be able to, to write a niggin like this, but I said to myself that if I ever compose in the gunam, I want to, I want to do that. I want to feel that it's I'm dragging it out of my heart. So we're going to sing it a couple of times without words just to get into the niggin. Again, this is not like a advertising thing, but this is a really important thing. So Khabra, if you want to, if you want to share the link on your feed on Instagram and, uh, on Instagram or Facebook or YouTube, just share the feed, share the feed, share the link. And what's what? On WhatsApp. On WhatsApp, just to get more people here, because everybody needs this. There's no question about it. I am Israel, I am Israel. 
So I want to sing for you a Moshe Tzernigan. A Moshe Tzernigan to the words of, uh, for all those, by the way, who are requesting uh, the one, the, the Nagunam that are mine, believe me that I'm flattered and I appreciate it and we'll do it a different time. But tonight is just dedicated to trying to sing some Nagunam that are a little bit older, that have more spiritual, you know, potency than, uh, than my own humble ones. And believe me, I appreciate all of you guys asking. And maybe we'll do one at the end. We'll do maybe Venacha at the end. Yes, we'll do Venacha at the end. We'll do oh Venacha at the end. So stay tuned. We'll do Venacha and maybe Kikara. We'll do at the end. This is like, like an advertisement saying, you know, stay tuned for the thing at the end just to make sure you guys stay here. Everybody stay here regardless. And uh, so we'll do Venacha and Kikara at the end. I want to sing one tune from the words that we sing on Shabbos. We say, we sing a tune, Karibon, we sing it in Aramaic. And I just want to explain the words before we sing. We say, Karok yas anach mipum aryavasa. Please redeem the small little sheep from the mouth of the lion. All the little children and all the mothers and fathers and grandparents who are pure, the Am Yisrael, who are being held in the mouth of the lion, a terrible, terrible evil. The Apek Yas Amech Migol Galusa, and then that's on a personal level, but on a global level, take out the nation of Israel from the exile. Amech Divechart Mikolumaya. I think I may be skipping words, but. Basically, the point is clear that we're asking Hashem to take a take that grip of evil that's on us right now, that sh showed its ugly face to us the past couple of weeks. And Amir Hashem, we should be zochet to dance to Yerushalayim together. So this is a, a nigan that I'm sure a lot of you know. And please, even though we can't see you, we can't hear you, it's really appreciated. And it gives us chizik to know that you're staying on and that you're sharing it. And then we believe that this is uh, special. So... Yeah, we see the numbers. People are staying on.
like to introduce my brother-in-law, Gershon. And he's going to take you to a very, very good place. Here we go. Everybody, thank you for joining. Thank you for giving us a chance to uh, help you connect and get in touch. So, uh, um, Gershon is a Tanzed. Um, some people may know me as Nurse G uh, or Breath Coach, but nonetheless, I'm uh, here with you. I'm just another one, just another one of us, another one of you. So, before we start, and as we settle into uh, a calming practice, I just uh, just want to bring to your attention that it would be best to uh, sit in a comfortable position uh, where you're not straining your back or your feet uh, or lying down on the floor. It's fine too, or lying in your bed, as long as you're not straining yourself and you feel comfortable. Uh, of course, if you're driving, you certainly can follow the instructions, but uh, I would keep your eyes open regardless of what I say. So, um, and if your nose is stuffed by chance, right now might be a time to to uh, have a drink of water, perhaps some tissues if you want. <laughs> Blow your nose, uh, maybe try to clear it if possible, because it certainly would be helpful to have access to your to your nose. Okay. So, with your feet on the ground and your back supported. Perhaps your arms on your lap or lying down wherever you may be. Just join me as we take two slow and gentle breaths. So I'm breathing in through the nose. Ah, out with the mouth again, breathing in through the nose. Ah, closing your eyes or lowering your gaze with the out breath, whatever feels comfortable. And together, we're going to slow down your breath. I'm going to count using my voice, and then we'll add some music tones as well, just to guide you. So if you're able to, it's best to breathe in and out through your nose, just keeping your mouth closed. And there's no need to be perfect. Just do what comes to you naturally. So, with our eyes closed or our gaze lowered, just ask me to soften the muscles around your eyes. Can you soften the muscles around your eyes? Just letting them be at least tender. Softening the muscles around your eyebrows, our forehead, softening the muscles of your cheeks, your mouth, your jaw. Softening the muscles of your neck and your shoulders. Just letting them soften and drop. Softening the muscles of your spine all the way from the top of your spine going all the way down to your lower back, one by one giving them permission just to let go. Softening your chest. Your 
the belly. Your upper legs. Moving down to your lower legs. And your feet. Just softening all the muscles. Now, as I said, together we're going to slow down your breathing. If you're able to breathe in and out through your nose, just follow my voice. Breathing in, two, three. Breathing out, two, three. In, two, three. And out. Two, three, in, gently, three, and out, two, three, in, softly, three, and out, two, three, in through the nose, two, three, and out, two, in, two, three, four, and out, two, three, four, in, gently, easy does it, four, out, easy does it, three, four, in, as I turn on the tones, Hearing the tones go up, that's your cue to breathe in. And as you hear the tones go down, just breathing out. Breathing in. Breathing out. And as the tones go down, just following the tones. Breathing in. Breathing out. Easy does it. Breathing in, breathing out as you hear the tones go down. Just let it be relaxed, effortless. In through the nose, the back of the throat. Out through the nose. In and out, easy does it. Need to be perfect, just feeling the breath in your nose and throat. And letting it go. And if you find your mind wandering, it's okay, that's what minds do. Just come back to the sensation of the breath going in and out. Breathing out. You got it. Breathing in. Breathing out.
No need to completely fill your lungs with air, just small steps of air. And letting it go, just easily. find that you can't complete the cycle, you run out of breath, you could just pause and wait till the cycle to end and then continue. Just coming back to the feeling of the breath going in and out of the nose. Just this one breath. So it goes in with the tones, go up, and out as the tones go down. Just doing it as best as you can, just with ease. Can you be in this moment with ease? Just feeling your breath. Breathing in as the tones go up, breathing out as the tones go down. Just easy does it, gentle and soft. If you find yourself working a little too hard, just invite a smile on your face. A smile helps everything, especially breathing. Breathing in as the tones go up, just letting it all go as the tones go up. And as I lower the notes, allowing your breath Come back to the rhythm that it wants to be in, keeping our eyes closed, our gaze lowered. Just tuning inward. Can you put all your attention on the soles of your feet? And putting all your attention on your ankles. And keeping your eyes closed, can you put all your attention on the area opposite your knees where your legs bend? Moving up, putting all our attention on the area where our legs meet the rest of our body. Can you put all your attention on your hands? And 
moving up and putting all our attention in the area opposite your elbows, your arms bent. Moving all our attention to your stomach, inside, belly. And can you put all your attention in your heart space? Are you putting your hand on your heart? Just feeling the aliveness. Allowing yourself to experience the grief and the burning desire for a healed world. Promise of peace, unconditional love. Just taking a moment to get in touch and welcome and cultivate Hashem's unconditional love of us. Perhaps visualizing small bits of oxygen that look like the most smiley emojis coming through your lungs with each breath saying i trust you i love you i believe in you Moving up, putting all our attention in our mouth, our jaw. Putting all your attention in really the area between your eyes, space between your eyes. And putting all your attention on the top of your head. Taking one more moment just to allow and welcome and visualize the greatest beam and brightness of light coming down from above, projecting through your head, connecting your heart to your head. Feeling all the love, all the trust that we have and we are as divine beings. Allowing a smile to come back to your face if it's not there. Noticing the feeling of your body on the chair or the ground or the bed that you're on. Noticing, noticing the sounds in the room that you're in or around you. Noticing the sensations in your body, your thoughts. And joining for two gentle, relaxing breaths, breathing in through the nose. Out through the mouth, again breathing in through the nose. Ah, opening our eyes or lifting our gaze. Just coming back to the room. Back to me and Eitan. We bring some more music to end the night.
thank you so much for joining us tonight. Once again, Gershon Braun. He didn't tell me to do this, but this is what we need. We need people like him giving people around the world, especially our brothers and sisters, the proper direction for not just relief of anxiety, not just surviving this, but thriving through it. And uh, Gershon is mamish like a shliach from Hashem in, uh, in uh, providing this service for Klal Yisrael. So you know where to find him. Gershon Braun. I don't know what all of his Facebook, Instagram stuff is, but I'm sure if you tap it's it in. Divine Breath of Love on Instagram. Divine Breath Divine of Breath Love. Of love. Or help actualized on uh, on Facebook. All right. Rich Hashem, to all the people out there, we're going to be doing this more often now. I see that the people enjoy these live streams. I barely ever do them because there's not that much time. But uh, over the next week or so, I'm going to be in Rich Hashem in South Africa for the next week, doing events for the the Holy Jews of Johannesburg, and maybe we'll do a live uh, safari concert. What do you say? <laughs> you gotta bring me though. <laughs> a live safari comes. It's, that would be fun. <laughs> All right. Good night, everybody. Cold tube. Have a wonderful night. Take care. Gotta get all this stuff. Uh, finish. Finish. And now, post for 30 days. Oh, sorry, YouTube. You guys gotta go too. Sorry. One second. And in stream. Thank you.